So here we're given three conditions for the definite integrals of this um, function g, continuous function. And we need to figure out what the, based on these, uh, what the value of the integral is from 1 to 2. So I have to kind of create this uh, from these relationships. So uh, if we look at this, I can split this from uh, uh, 0 to 2 and then 2 to 3. Uh, is that going to help? Um, let's see, 2 to 3. Yep, I can. It, it will because if I do 0 to 2 plus 2 to 3, that's equal to 5. So all I'm doing is rewriting this piece. That piece is 7. So that means 2 to 3 is equal to minus 2. Now this can be split into 1 to 2 plus 2 to 3. And that's equal to minus 1. That's the condition. The reason I d did that is because this is what my interest is, that piece here. This is given to us as minus 2, which means that 1 to 2 g of x dx would be minus 1 plus 2. Moving that to the other side, that's equal to 1. That's the answer.